undisclosed location. It's one of the most um, secretive yet well known. As soon as we, the paradox is what they call it. Coffee bars in Chicago. This is like this is very elite coffee. Yep. about as fancy as it gets. Good coffee? No, no. Amazing coffee. Mm, amazing. This is... So upon... First, first let's give an overview. This is a... Yeah. This is a Tanzanian pea berry. Three pi primary tasting notes are grapefruit, um, fig, <laughs> and cocoa. I'm getting a little nut. I'm getting a little bit of nut too. <laughs> hey, who's under the table? <laughs> <laughs> like maybe some uh, pistachio? I'm getting a little nut. Are you getting any pistachio? I'm definitely getting pistachio, maybe even some dried tomatoes. One of my biggest fans right I here. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's the coffee. It's yeah. the, they have here. Yeah, this is uh, we're right now doing a coffee review. You gotta be spitting it out. <laughs> not coffee that's this good. <laughs> Yeah, right off the bat, um, that grapefruit just really hits the front of your palate. And then that that cocoa on the finish um, smooths things out really, really nicely. They probably stopped this about 27 minutes after first crack. Um, pretty, <laughs> pretty, pretty light roast. I wanna I want to make sure that I'm getting the full effect of the true flavor of the coffee. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it needs some of that. Absolutely. Yeah, open it up. Open it up. Yeah. You, you want some of this? Yeah, absolutely. Huh. What you have to do with any good coffee, especially when you're trying to maintain the integrity of the original bean, is um, as much cream and sugar as possible. Uh, Wait, is that actual sugar? Because you want to use like a sweet, sweet and low with the chemical. Sweet, sweet really low is coming. You see? It's the flammable aspect. Yes. You want some sugar? I'm going to hold off on the sugar for now. Like berries and stuff now. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, this is amazing. What what brew method do you think this? Like raspberries. Came from? Oh, this is. They probably back there brewing this up one pot at a time with a V60. Yeah, probably. Got to be a V60. And they're and, and it's all being ground just before they brew it with a hand grinder. They have an army of people back there. Yeah. We, we could show you a shop, but it give away our location. But um, there's just, you can see people flooding into the back rooms with hand grinders trying to keep up with the demand. So what do you say, on a scale of uh, 1 to 10? I mean, I, I got to give it an outstanding. Yeah. Yeah. I at least have to give it an incredible. for your uh, expert. Expertise. You tell by your I tried to uh, apply my coffee knowledge to great well, coffee. No, yeah, yeah. I think that's what happened here tonight. Definitely. Thanks, Peter. Thank you. You should take your last pastry to go.